What's up, everyone? So uh, this one is about um, basically letting people go, and if people want to walk out of your life, let them. <clears throat> and also, if you know deep down in your heart, when you were with them, you did everything that you possibly could to please them, and it just wasn't enough, then that's it. It's their loss, and sooner or later, they're going to realize what they had. That's the thing. You're not everyone's cup of tea in this life, and you just got to be all right with uh, being alone and uh, just getting your own shit done on your own because uh, at the end of the day, nobody really got you like you got yourself, and those are real... Uh, cold hard facts and just the truth and the fact of the matter is that if you really want to be successful and follow your own path not everyone's going to follow you and not everyone's going to ride with you you know you, you can consider yourself very lucky if you find that one person that's going to stick with you th through all of the struggles and build with you uh, to get where you want to be at the same time and actually support you and is actually there for you no matter what. It's super rare to find that these days and not all of us are too for very fortunate to actually find that. So we actually got to do that ourselves. You know, it's, you know, it's, it's just, it's so fucked up, you know. Um, the girl that I met for the first time five days ago already, uh, this past Sunday, it's Friday today already. As soon as like I realized she deleted me off of Facebook and stuff after we meet it for the first time in person, like I didn't do anything wrong. I did everything I possibly could. Like I was a real gentleman. Um, I was really respectful. You know, I didn't try anything. I'm like, I didn't do anything bad. You know, I was myself and I treated her fair. I treated her great. And she just deletes me like as soon as like she leaves on Facebook and stuff like that. And she never contacted me since. And I never contacted her since either. I just let her go. And a few days ago, she actually viewed my profile on the dating app that we met on. Because like that's a sign that she like wanted me to chase her and feel sorry for myself and stuff like that. Like, yeah, it hurt. But I'm not going to go on my way to try to convince someone to love me or care about me. I got more, I got responsibilities. I can't focus on people who don't give a shit about me. Uh, I got to focus on myself and love myself and put myself first and care about me and do what I got to do to get to where I want to be in my life. So it's like I said, if they want to leave, let them. But like I said, you're going to realize what they lost. And that's just the way some people are. It takes them losing you to realize what they had, but they try to come back then it's too late because they had their chance and they blew it you know what i mean guys i'm sure you've went through this type of situation before as well like i went through it many times with other people as well but it just really sucks when it happens all over again you know you, you feel like you have such a strong connection at first and then whew, just goes blows right out of the water in your face and then you got to accept it and move on you can't feel sorry for yourself you just got to keep on moving on moving on pushing on and pushing on but anyways, uh, today is a pretty good day, guys. Uh, I finished a six week of work, uh, 10 weeks left of work to go. Um, I just did my cardio downstairs, half hour on the bike. I get my cardio in for today. It was a really hot day at work, so I did some extra cardio on my bike downstairs. And uh, I'm just making my supper now. Um, and then I'm gonna go cut my hair. Cause I like to keep my hair short for the summer, and especially when I'm working out a lot so I don't sweat as much, you know? Um, just taking care of myself, put myself first, and, uh, just getting shit done. You know, life is what you make it, guys. No matter what, no matter how difficult the situation, you gotta put yourself first, and you gotta always stay positive, keep that positive mindset to keep yourself going strong. Uh, you know, health is wealth. You gotta make sure you're healthy and and good to go each day, and, uh, taking care of yourself, um, physically, mentally, stuff like that, so... Anyways, uh, you realize you don't really need anyone more than you need yourself. You know, if, if people don't want you, they don't want you. You can't convince anyone of your worth and stuff like that. The wrong people, no matter how hard you try, it's just never going to be enough for them. So 
Don't waste your time trying to force someone to love you or care about you, whatever, all that bullshit. So take care, guys. Have a good one and good night. I'll probably be back with another one maybe in about a week or so. I'm not sure, but uh, I'll, I'll come up with something. I, I just paid off that uh, WWE Spinner replica belt with the gold tip. So I'll probably be doing an unboxing video of that next week or so for you guys. So stay tuned. Have a good day. Take care, folks. Stay positive and uh, be strong. Don't let this world get you down. Take care.